My business coach taught me the value of review. Go back to what you have learned, what you have read, and review it. So, why do we review? Well, he says it will increase your value. I say, why do you increase your value? Well, that's because when you increase your value, you can invest this in your future experience. So what does that mean? Well, I'll give you an example. Well, one year ago, I'm struggling to learn Power BI. I mean, really, really struggling. I have little money. I... Uh, and I was just uh, kind of recover from a very deep depression due to MCO. Mm, I think a lot of people are struggling there as well. So I I really struggled to a point that I only watch one. F- well, I only can understand one function for an hour or two hours and after that I, I quickly close the laptop and I just go to sleep I mean claw to the back to sleep I was in that deep depression but thank God thank God that I recover bit by bit so today I I was in the middle of preparing the Power BI for strategic HR so I I want to talk about last month the salary for last month so in order to do the salary for last month the first thing is to create a date table. So I, I, I how do I know why I review of what I have, what I have recorded while we're still struggling the time, and I came across this. So that was great. And what is this all about? Now at the time, I suddenly see a, a bunch of this data. I was like, oh, what is it? It's like, so difficult at the time. Now, but today. It's a different story. I already know what is that, what's calendar, and uh, what's first date. So, calendar is basically this. So I'm, I'm pretty clear of what that DAX function is all about. So calendar, right? It it returns a table. So how do you create a table calendar? So it says that if you want to, uh, create that, what you do is that uh, you will go to here right see that I actually created a table so how do you create a table let's just let me just delete this table from uh, but before that let me show you what it means see this is the list and this list start from 1 to uh, so on right so let's see if I can get see this aha uh-huh, here so January 1st of January 2021 to uh, December 31 to of 2021 so that is how we create a, a list of that year data so it's very powerful uh, the thing is that it's not dynamic but anyway let's learn the basic right so go back to here so I'm going to delete this and show you how to do this one more time all right see it's deleted so to create a new table you go to um, insert nope modeling no nope. yes there is right it's a new table hey ah okay that's a new table so do I have a new table here nope uh, not yet no right so let's go to modeling click on new table okay is is at this table here you get that name okay you can just get that uh my uh 
dates in 2021. Okay, that's years in Kenyan to one, and then you check in the calendar. Now there are two type of calendars. One well, is calendar, and the other is auto. So I will just go step by step, right? You just learn one thing. Wouldn't take you a lot of time. So calendar, and after that, um, I want to enter the uh this year, the first day of this year. So which is date, and the year is twenty twenty two. And first, uh, January, first, then comma, then date. So this is the end dates, right? You created a calendar, so as if you created a physical calendar, you want to put in the chapter uh, January until December. So let's just put there all the date. You want to list out all the dates. So it used to be taking a lot of time, right? Now it's not the case. And twelve and thirty first, and enter all right so i have a date that is a date column so notice that the calendar does not create a, a it, i did not specify a date column but this calendar will create a date column for you so it will be just like what you've seen earlier that is the date column so this is what it means, right? When you use the calendar function, okay. Calendar function, uh, return a single column. See, it returns a single column that contains a contiguous set of, okay, it's continually, right? So the range was from the specific start date to be specified, and start date inclusive of those two days. So it's inclusive. Cool. So that is how you create a calendar. Now, the next thing we want to talk about in the next video is how to uh, make it even more dynamic with uh, that refer to whatever the date that it found, what is the first date that is found in the in my hash data. And that will be another next episode. Thanks for watching. In this video, you learn how to create a calendar uh, a calendar right by using the calendar function and enter the start date and the uh, end date yes they only need two start date and end date that's all so here is the example right this is why i showed you earlier so thanks for watching god bless you best Asia. I hope that those who are in the depression, taking depression pills, can recover with the um, with the help of God. Not easy. Except that um, it's not easy to recover. Oh, you can. And uh, you, you do it one at a time. Slowly. Consistently doing one thing. Or maybe just take five minutes a day. And then the next thing is like, go back to sleep or anything. But schedule a time. I mean, schedule a time. So do something very useful for the community and hopefully you can recover from that above all pray to God you are you are more capable more powerful than you think you are now you just don't know so once you realize that and you can move on it took me a year plus to really recover fully from depression and um, not easy okay not easy mm. those sleeping pills doesn't work for me <laughs> I just wake up right so thank you so uh, and also 
Malaysia also struggling for many years and every year is struggling and well still we get a chance to celebrate our uh, 65 kemerdekaan Merdeka 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 It means that independent so independence in terms of that we have the own rights to decide uh, how we use our time and uh, use the fund collected tax uh, it doesn't mean that independent doesn't mean that we don't work together with other country well it's the same thing that um, I'm an independent uh, freelancer it doesn't mean I don't work with others other trainers so think about that okay okay God bless you God bless Asia together we excel before 50